hide out of the gingerbread house, a mean witch flew down on her broom, and she said, I'm going to get you, you naughty kids. <gasps> they were scared. What a horrible witch. I guess so. Oh. Witches are awful. Lulu, Lulu, we're going to go to the park. You want to come with us? Oh, I can't, Tubby. I'm babysitting Alvin. Oh, come on, Lulu. Let's go to the park. We'll have a lot of fun there. Hey, I want to go to the hey! park. Hey! Alvin, you get back here. I told your mother I was going to babysit for you. Now you stay here and be a good boy. That's right. Alvin's just too small. He's got to have somebody look over him. <laughs> come on. What a baby. <laughs> I don't want to be babysat anymore. Now, Alvin, try to understand. You're just a little boy. Now, come on, sit down, and I'll tell you another fairy tale. Lulu has promised to stay here and babysit for Tubby while we're gone. Isn't that nice? Lulu, you take good care of our house and our Tubby. Okay, don't worry about a thing. Just leave the babysitting to me. This is ridiculous. I'm not a baby. I don't need a babysitter, and I especially don't need you. Now, now, Tubby, you be a good boy and listen to what Lulu says. Goodbye. Yes, son, you'll be in good hands with Lulu babysitting. Goodbye, children. Okay, just leave everything to me. Goodbye. I can't believe this. You babysitting for me? Come on, Tubby, this is gonna be fun. I know, I'll tell you a fairy tale. A fairy tale? Come on! What do you think I am? I'm not a baby like Alvin. But everybody likes hearing fairy tales, especially from me. Hi, Lulu. Hi, Tubby. What are you guys doing? Oh, uh, hi, Iggy. I'm babysitting for Tubby. Stop it. Iggy, don't believe her. She's lying. She's lying. No, really. His parents asked me to. Ah! I don't believe it. Lulu babysitting for Tubby? Wait till I tell the gang about this. Boy, will they laugh. Ah! Hey, wait! Don't tell him. If you tell him, I'll knock your head off. Hey, everybody! Lulu's babysitting for Tubby! Lulu's babysitting for Tubby! Ah! Come back! Come back! Ah. Now, look what you've done. If this gets out, I'll be ruined. Ah. Ah. I'll never be able to show my face. Oh, so what? Oh, Lulu, you don't understand. You're a girl. I'm begging you, Lulu. Please go home. Please go home before the gang gets here. Please, I'm begging you. No, I promised your parents I'd watch you. Absolutely not. Lulu, doesn't friendship mean anything to you? No matter what you say, a promise is a promise. You can't do this to me. You don't have to be ashamed. You and I are good friends. There's nothing wrong with us staying home together. <sighs> That's it, Lulu. You're no friend of mine. Thanks a lot. You really messed things up this time. You'll be sorry. Boy, would I like to get her back, boy. story. Tubby, what's wrong with your voice? Tell me about monsters. Uh, if you like. I see that you know. Huh? Know what? Actually, I am a monster. Huh? Then where's Tubby? Tubby is in the forest shaking with cold. I took his clothes, disguised myself as him, and came here. If you doubt me, go to the forest and see. You ready, Christ Tubby, who's naked and cold? You can't trick me. <laughs> I bet 
you're just making this up to get me out of the house. You're so silly. <laughs> you don't believe... You don't believe me. Silly. I wonder what he's doing up there. Somebody who looks exactly like me in the house? Yeah, but... Well, that's him. It's the monster. He disguised himself as me. Lulu, what are you doing here alone in this house? Babysitting you. What? You're babysitting the monster. Well, you mean that one's really the monster? Of course. You've been alone here in this house all by yourself. With the monster, and you didn't even know it. I can't believe you're still safe. <laughs> Wait, I think I'd better have a word with him first. I want to get my clothes back, too. Oh, Tubby, be careful. <laughs> there he is. Lulu, Lulu, stay where you are. Oh. I'll sneak around the back and take care of him. Monster's gone. Where'd he go? He went to your house. Uh -huh. He asked me where he could get something good to eat around here. So I sent him away to your house. Uh -huh. He's probably there right now, Lulu. If I were you, I'd run home right away. He's probably already disguised himself as you, eaten up all the food in the house and scared all the neighbors. Uh -huh. Sure is. You better hurry home and warn all the neighbors about the monster. Oh, I will. Bye. <laughs> Look 
Look over there. Yeah, look. Didn't I tell you? Lulu's babysitting Tubby. You're right. Lulu, there's the gang. You please go home now. I'm begging you. I really am. Please. Mm -hmm. No, you made up all that stuff about that monster. I can't trust you. Isn't it surprising? He's really being babysat. How about that? He's a baby, too. Hey, Tubby, how come she's not telling you fairy tales? <sighs> come on, guys. Listen, that's not fair. Why don't you stop picking on Tubby and go play? Okay, let's go play hide and go seek in the park. Yeah. <laughs> Tubby, we've been out here long enough. Let's go inside and have a snack, okay? Darn it, don't tell me what to do. I'm here to take care of you, and I said it's snack time. Hmm, let's see. I wonder what there is in the house to eat. Oh, I know. Wilbur, get over here right now. Yes, Tubby, what is it? Wilbur, you gotta get me out of this mess. Oh? I can't stand the gang laughing at me anymore. I know exactly how you feel, Tubby. There's only one way out, and that's to get rid of little Lulu. I got an idea. Here it is. There we go, the perfect snack. Huh? Tubby, what's that noise? I don't know. Hmm, that's strange. Oh, no! Uh. All right, who did this? I don't know, Lulu. I was on the sofa all the time reading the funny papers. Strange, the water runs by itself and the light's going on and off. It must be the ghost. A ghost? Yeah, a ghost. There's this ghost that lives in the house. And it gets really mad when strangers stay too long. It makes a lot of noise and... Is that the ghost too? Sounds like it. You must be very, very angry today. I'd better not tell you. It's too horrible. If he gets too angry, he might do anything. Anything? Oh, I knew it. I knew it. I knew I shouldn't have told you. Now the secret's out. Well, I'm not afraid. <laughs> I bet Lulu was gonna eat them all by herself. Some friend, I'll fix her. I've got it! Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now let's eat plenty of salad dressing for color. Some black pepper. A teaspoon of salt for flavor. And of course, Tabasco sauce. And there we have it, the Tubby Tompkins special of the day. Yummy! Well, Tubby, I checked around upstairs. You know, I think there is a ghost up there. Well, I told you so, Lulu. <laughs> She'll be eating that cereal soon, and now we're gonna see some real fireworks. It's snack time. Here's your cereal. You mean that cereal was for me? Yes, of course. Who else but you? 
No thanks. I'm not hungry. You can have it, Lulu. Now you eat this right now. I promised your mother I'd take care of you and I made this cereal especially for you. Here. Do I have to? Yes, and you better finish it. those noises? I didn't hear anything. I knew I heard something, but Wilbur isn't around. Oh no! Help! Help! There it is! what it is. Uh, well, of course. That's what I was going to do all the time. That Lulu's been playing a trick on me. I'll get even with her. Smelling salt. Is this it? No, is this? Is this? Uh. Yeah, that's it. Lulu. Lulu? Uh. Lulu! Lulu, where'd you go? Uh. <laughs> Boy, I just can't believe it. She got me with my own trick. There's nothing to be afraid of. What's the matter? Are you scared of mice? <laughs> oh. Oh. Thank you, Tubby. You saved me. Sure, Lulu. <laughs> I'm 
mess. Oh, help me, Tubby, get rid of him. Save me, save me. Uh, 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 Lulu, did you see something? Oh, it must be your imagination. Yeah, I think we were playing too hard. Hey, there's Mom and Dad. I think we gave them quite a fright. I didn't expect them to react so. We can't just leave them lying on the floor. We better sit them up. I've got my key, dear. I do hope the children are all right. Sound asleep. They must have had a nice, quiet afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> 